The 27-year-old from Bulwell died after being shot in Nottingham's Lace Market on the 25th of May. It comes on the day that an anti-gun campaign group launched a new film aimed at young people. It's hard-hitting and shows the impact gun and knife crime has on Nottingham. Gita Penze reports. Guns, knives, destroy lives. It's a strong message and one that campaigners seen at this year's Nottingham Carnival have been trying to get through. Today they're launching a DVD showing the effects of violent crime in the city. It was only last month that 27-year-old Bernard Langton was found dead in the lace market, the first fatal shooting in two and a half years. Now campaigners are trying to get through to youngsters who may be drawn into gangs. Peer pressure is a big deal for them. They believe they have to have a certain status. Uh, they believe they've got to keep up the historic uh, gang culture attitude. Um, and it's wrong. It's, a, it's just a mindset which has been misleading. The film speaks to the relatives of those who've died, as well as former gang members. The families which have lost loved ones who have played a role want to do this for the ones they've lost in, in, in showing support for trying to discourage more young people dying. And I think that's great for Nottingham because, you know, we've not got the best reputation, but I think this DVD, Guns, Knives and Destroy Lies, will actually uh, change that perception. The DVD will be sent to schools across Nottingham in the hope youngsters will see the harsh realities of violence. Geeta Pense, East Midlands Today.